was a day, just like any other day, until a dame walked into my door. A dame by the name of Mom. Evan! Come look at this. Uh-oh. Do you know who did this? Don't worry, Mom. I'll find the criminal that did this. There are clues everywhere. Whoever had done this had made a mess. The clues told me a story only I could read. It was time to start asking questions. Oh, Evan. And then we both know what's going on. Why do you have my shoe? I found it overturned at the crime scene. And you're the only one in the house with big feet. I do have big feet. And inside your shoe I found this. Fine, I was practicing my dance moves. I didn't want anyone to know, and I had taken off my shoes so I could practice my moonwalk. Then I heard a weird noise, like someone approaching. I got scared and ran out of the room, leaving my shoes there. So you caught me. I was dancing, but I didn't break that face. It turns out Daddy T was only guilty of busting a move. So it was on to the second clue. I know it was you, Julian. I found the broken carrot. So what? It could have been anyone's carrot. Don't lie to me. You've been caught orange-handed. Admit you broke the vase. Fine, it was my care, but I didn't break the vase. I was practicing for the annual care eating contest. That's when I heard a strange sound, like someone approaching. I ran through the living room and must have dropped a carrot. But it was in one piece when I left it, so I'm guilty of nothing but a big appetite. So it wasn't the little sister. That left only three choices. Mommy Tube, me, or my invisible friend Wallace. But Wallace has been on vacation in Hawaii, so it couldn't have been him. All right, Evan, did you do it? No. Good enough for me. That left only one person. The dame who started it all, Mommy Tube. What am I doing here? I found the broken base which made it the perfect crime. Let me explain what happened. When you came to see me, you were limping like you had just fallen. I think you were practicing your skateboarding in the house. You went into the living room, tripped over Dad's shoe, slept on Jillian's Whoa! carrot, and then knocked the vase off the shelf where it smashed into the floor. Fine, it was me. I did it. I broke the vase trying to be a great skateboarder. But you know what? I'm allowed to break things and skateboard in the house. I'm a grown-up. Mom, you're grounded. Sorry, Jillian. Good job, Evan. No problem, Dad. And that's the story of the case of the broken vase. Was he talking to himself? 